everybody. Today I'm going to show you my Stanley Timing Twin 2 Outlet Daily Mechanical Timer. Now, so this has two outlets on each side. It has, uh, it repeats daily. You can see the pins. Here's, right, here's a switch when you turn on and off. We can put it, so you put it in on position or you can put it in timer. So we're going to be go ahead and open this up for a moment, and we'll see what it's inside. Alright, so I'll open up the packaging, let's go ahead and see what's inside. Ready for this? Excited to see. Try to open this one. Oh, take the timer out of its packaging. This is a hard package. Alright, that freaking package was just like shit all day. It doesn't even want to open. So what this all works kind of great. See how I did this. I just ripped this out. It's not good. Package epic fail. Here's the timer itself. As you can see, it's got that outlet in there. As you can see, we have our pins. If I can do this with my finger. This is how you put the pins up or down and this is your switch so you can put it on or you can put it in timer on the left hand and right hand side both sides we have our outlets the left one and the right one now if you want to power a fan without blowing your motor out you can by plugging these two outlets in without uh, burning your motor uh, let's see what's inside this pad let's see what's inside there's the instruction manual again nothing too fancy Here's the timer itself. So I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate it in on mode. So, so that we can get a demonstration. Oh, that's a routine timer. Oh yeah, it has a routine timer. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and plug this in. I'm going to go ahead and test my charger real quick. I don't see any power light indicating it's on, so I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in my charger. <clears throat> see if I can get it all the way. There he goes. So I'm, now I'm gonna go ahead and test my tap for charging feature. I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in. And it works. Timer. Let's put it on. I'm going to go ahead and switch back to the timer. Yeah, two-way switch. You can put it in timer or you can put it right here. Here I have my adjustable timer. Let's see what time it is right now. 7.14. If you want to put it at 7, put it p.m. Yes, 7.14. Or if I take the pins out, then the timer goes out. If I turn it, it makes a click sound and then it starts shooting. You want to turn it back on, push the pins up, down. Now, next, I'm going to test out with the light. I'm going to go ahead and unplug that outlet first. As you can see, it's just disconnecting the internal charger to let you know. And now, I'm going to go ahead and plug. This is my outlet. I'm gonna go ahead and test my night light right here. I really didn't I usually got that one. But I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in. And night light works. Again. If you wanna. Alright, the daily time it is right now. If you wanna turn off, take out the pins. Pin isn't going down. Isn't going down all the way? There it goes. So you can turn the timer. It has a motor on it. So you can set which time. 
Would you prefer? For example, if I prefer like seven thirty or something, take out the pins and push it back in. And there it goes. If you want to put in standard air conditioning, this can run up to 30 minutes. If you want to put it on, put it on. I'm going to go ahead and unplug it. And the lamp shuts off. Okay. So this is how Stanley Timer Twin works as possible. If I put it on my regular outlet, then it doesn't have a built-in timer function. So I hope you enjoyed this video of my Stanley Timer Twin mechanical timer. And also, please comment, rate, and subscribe, and thank you very much for watching.